hex problem tayo so shortcut naman ng mixture problem ng differential equation so ano to uh, special case special case kapag yung rate out is equal to rate in then yung added substance so yung dinadagdag natin na substance is that fresh water so sample meron tayong sample A tank initially contains 50 gallons of brine solution with 10 pounds of salt. A T is equal to 0. Another brine solution containing 2 pounds of salt per gallon is poured into the tank at, at the rate of 5 gallon per minute. While the well, the, well, the well stirred mixture leaves the tank at the same rate. So, rate out is equal to rate in. So, Tapos yung ina-add natin na, na solution. Ina-add natin na solution is hindi water. So, ang dinadagdag natin is brine solution. So, meaning na meet natin yung special case. So, what is the amount of salt at the end of 5 minutes? So, meron akong formula. So, itong formula na to is dinarive ko siya. So, ito yung general equation ng special case. So, meron tayong 1 over rate out ln so, ln rin sin vo minus soro is equals sa tibo plus c. So, ganun ako mag-memorize ng formula. So, pag ginamit mo tong formula na to, direct substitution lang yung problem. Okay, yung concentration in is 2, 2 pound salt per gallon. So, ano siya, uh, density. Then, yung rate is volume flow rate. So, volume flow rate is, so, volume, so, gallon per minute. So, yung rate out sa rate in is the same and volume is the volume ng container. Then, yung SO is substance. SO is uh, initial amount of the substance. So, hindi to, uh, hindi to substance added. Uh, in initial amount siya. So, meaning yung amount at T is equal to 0. Amount ng substance at T is equal to 0. Then, time is 0. So, meron, so direct substitution lang to So, negative. So, meron tayong rate in. Meron na, na tayong concentration in. Meron na tayong volume. Meron tayong rate out. Meron tayong initial substance. So, ang yung initial substance natin is initial amount of salt yun yung S initial amount of salt is 10 so meaning wala tayong C so ang unang step natin is hanapin natin yung C so, hanapin natin yung C at T is equal to 0 so magitong 0 yung numerator magiging 0 so the rest magiging 0 na to so C is equal na dito ditong side na to so negative so 1 over rate out is 5 ln r in is 5 concentration in is 2 yung volume is 50 gallons minus initial amount of of salt. So, initial amount of salt is 10 pound. Minus 10. So, times rate out na 5. So, ito na yung C. Kasi ito, 0 na to. Then, ayan na yung value. Do, store natin sa A. Shift. Store. A. 
equal. So, nakuha na natin yung A. So, balik tayo sa dati equation. So, ang hinahanap natin is, what is the amount of salt at the end of 5 minutes? So, yung so yung S, so yun yung amount of salt, gagawin natin X. So, yan yung hinahanap natin. Then, rate out. So, meron na tayong rate out. Gawin natin 5x na lang. 5x. 5, recall x. So, equals. Then, time. Time is uh, 5. Then, volume is initial volume is 50. 50. Plus, so yung C is nakastore sa A, recall A. Then, shift solve. So, ayan na yun, A. Equals, equals. So, 45.41. So, sakto, sakto. So, ito yung answer. Ayan na, 45.41. So, direct substitution lang. Next problem tayo. So, same ng special case pa rin tayo. So, ang hinahanap naman natin is time. So, paano pag time naman yung hinahanap? So, same rate pa rin. Ayan. So, basahin nyo na lang. So, same rate. Same rate. Highlight lang natin to So, flows in at a rate of 3 gallons per minute. Then, flows out at the same rate. So, the same rate. Rate out is equal to rate in. So, pagpasensya nyo yung naulit nyo yung rate. So, yung rate out sa rate in is, is the same. Tapos, yung added uh, substance natin is salt yung dinadagdag natin. salt yung dinadagdag so so same uh, case din special case 1 to tinatawag natin tong special case number 1 so what when will when will the tank have 100 pounds so hanapin natin yung time so yung first uh, topic is yung content ng salt so sa next is time naman na 100 pounds na yung content na salt so, clear muna natin ship 9. Clear. Memory, okay. Then, direct substitution lang siya. So, negative 1. Overrate out is 3 gallon per minute. LN. So, rate in is 3. So, 3. Then, rate in is 3. Then, concentration in is 2. Then, initial volume is 100. Minus, so, so. So, hanapin muna natin yung C. Gaya nung step uh, problem number 1. So, initial amount of substance. Since fresh water siya, since fresh water, yung initial amount ng tank, ibig sabihin, zero na tong term na to. So, noon din na natin yan ilagay. Then, itong term naman na to, T over BO, since T is equal to zero, noon din na rin natin yan. So, C, so, ito na yung C natin. Ayan na yung C. Then, equals natin. Ayan. Ayan na yung value ng C. So, shift, store A. So, ano ba yung in-input natin? So, in-input ko na. So, negative. 1 over 3. So, 3 is rate out. LN. 
So, rate in is 3. Kasi same lang sila. Then, yung concentration is 2. Concentration is 2. And the initial volume is 100. BO. So, minus. So, Then, yung 100. So, yung cons uh, yung S is the content ng salt. So, inanap natin is yung salt is 100. So, kailan? So, what time? When will the tank have 100 pounds? So, ito yung S is 100. Hindi ito, ha? Hindi itong volume. So, ito yung S is the amount of salt. Then, rate out is 3. Equals. So, yung T is, yung, yung, yun yung hinahanap natin sa gawin natin na X. Then, yung volume is 100, ito. Plus A. So, nakastore naka sa A yung C. Then, shift. Solve. Equals. Solve for X. Equals. Then, ang lalabas is 23.10 minutes. So, ang answer is C. You know, 23.10 minutes. So, yan. So, gamit itong formula na to, direct substitution lang. Bale, madali naman siyang i-memorize.